Traffic congestion has become a serious issue in many cities. Not only is it a headache for motorists, but it's also having a negative economic impact. In the US and Europe, the annual cost of gridlock by 2030 will reach an astonishing $293 billion. The BRIC countries, China in particular, find themselves suffering from the same problem in recent years. To solve traffic-related problems, the most effective method is to establish accurate measurements. As it is with weather reports, people expect to know more than just hot or cold. They need the facts in order to proceed with planning their daily affairs. SAP Congestion Management Solution accurately evaluates the flow of a city's traffic. From a microgranular perspective at the road level to major traffic corridors across the city, it provides an overview of different zones and interprets congestion by applying quantitative analysis. In addition to providing real-time insight into traffic congestion, our solution offers ad hoc congestion analysis for congestion pattern learning, impact estimation, and root cause discovery, all crucial tools for better decision making. It also offers public travel guidance service to benefit both citizens and private companies. The application you're watching now is the Traffic Performance Index, or TPI for short. It runs 24-7 at the City Intelligence Operations Center in Nanjing, which is one of the largest cities in China. Since this application is designed for a screen 22 meters wide and 5 meters high, details will be shown by zooming in on the subscreens as they are discussed. Here we are looking at the map of a city. As you can see, there are a lot of different colored lines, each of which represent the major roads. Green indicates that the road is clear, while red suggests that the road is very congested. The red bubbles here represent the top congested expressways and the pink ones show the top congested major roads. Let's switch to the left side. Here we list the KPI values of different districts, including TCI and speed. Historical values are also listed for reference and comparison. Speaking of historical values, with SAP HANA, rather than average mathematical methods, we are now able to use different criteria and condition combinations to calculate historical data in real time. Here we can change the calculation criteria for historical values, including the date. And here we can choose the time range. Of course, we take weather conditions into account as well. For example, we can choose rainy days as your historical sample data. And as you can see, Compared with that on rainy days, today's TCI looks not so bad. Let's move to the right side. About a year ago, SAP got the chance to show our smart traffic innovations to the mayor of Nanjing. The very first question from the mayor was whether SAP could tell him which roads were congested most often. Now, with a look, the mayor can get the answers he needs right away based on billions of historical records. Our solution can also provide insight into the speed and traffic flow trends of chronically congested sections today with detailed charts. What about the congestion right now? Let's move back to the main screen and see how it goes. As you can see here, on the map there are several bubbles with numbers. These are the most congested major roads or expressways. Let's click on one of them to see the details. Concerning a congested road section, you can see inbound and outbound traffic flows to or from relevant roads and the average travel speed of given road sections. This is all information supporting on-demand analysis of the impact and spread of congestion. With on-site video stream, the travel time and estimated congestion duration can be provided as well. Here we see traffic monitoring from the district perspective. Let's switch to the road network mode. This is one of the most congested traffic corridors, and on the right side there's a speed matrix. 
From this matrix, you can get a general idea of the speeds on different road sections in different time slots. From this matrix, we may find that this road is congested in the morning. We can click on this button to see the opposite side of the road. The tide lane is one of the methods to mitigate traffic congestion of this kind. And by recognizing traffic conditions and probing into congestion patterns, city administrators could get a better picture of how current traffic runs and gain insights into the issue of traffic congestion. It will definitely help not only in daily management of traffic and generation of short-term traffic control procedures, but also in medium and long-term city infrastructure planning, tuning, and public service provisioning. SAP Smart Traffic helps city traffic run better.